Hey guys, Huzz here bringing you a, another video. Welcome back to the Huzzy account. And today has gone awful. Uh, we're actually Diamond 4. Um, yeah, like it's just been a really bad day. They happen. Um, it is what it is. You know, people have bad days in the office. This is a bad day in the office for me. So it's unfortunate, but we press on. We'll always bounce back. Why am I in the main account? Admiral Banter is currently on an eight game loss streak. And considering, well, technically Admiral Banner is now higher rating than the Huzzy account, but that eight game loss streak made me, made me go lower rating than this account originally in having that eight game loss streak. Um, I was like, ah, screw it. Considering it's now lower than the Huzzy account, I may as well just play on the Huzzy account or give it a go. So I don't know. Question of the day is like, what account if you do, and that's part of the question, do you care if I play on? Like, do you care like, do you want me to play on the Huzzy account? Do you like me on the Admiral Banner account? Do you literally not care? Like, I, just let me know. I'm not playing Garen because I think Garen's bad against Teemo. The premise of Yorick is the same as Garen, but Teemo can't blind all of us. And when I say all of us, Yorick, Maiden, or my ghouls, like, he can't blind all of that, you know? So, the hell's that positioning? I've not looked at Porofessor, if I'm completely honest. Dark Seal first is a little bit cocky from Teemo, considering how strong Doran's items are now. Yeah, I think most people don't have an like, insane attachment to what account I play on. They just want me to have... The, the biggest thing that I've always seen the feedback is, like, most people don't even care what rank I am. They just want me to have fun. But obviously, solo queue, that's hard. <laughs> hard to have fun sometimes in solo queue. To life. I would probably say, I would recently, I would say it's easier for me to have fun on the Admiral Banner account. I will say that. Basically just because there's not the pressure that the Huzzy account brings. And it's a it's it's a pressure that's hard to explain. But the moment that you just have your your named account, pressure goes up. Oh no, Timo's gonna get a free first blood. That sucks for me. Hope he doesn't. Okay, Timo got it. That sucks. Oh, I can't do that. Someone just said you could do the uh, the solo Renekton route. 50% ranked, 50% unranked for funny builds. I am a ranked player. Like, I I don't get the premise of normals anymore. And you might be like, what does that mean? Trying really hard and winning, spending half an hour, and then it's like a really difficult game. And then at the end of it, you have nothing really... There's no rank, rank at the end of it. I'm like, no. I think I'd lose my mind. Even if it grew my channel. Yeah, because I don't think I'd have fun with it. I just don't play normals. I don't find them fun. Ah, balls. I mistimed that. Doubt they're top lane. Would they really be top lane? Did Timo use flash or anything in that? I've got a little... Oh, yeah, he, he did not... Okay, hopefully he dies. Oh, wait, Viego is actually top still. Okay, at least he's dead, but that's still not great. Uh, da, 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 da. Hello there. Yeah, this is the type of thing that, like, I don't know this for a certain fact, but I'm pretty chill in this lane because I think I'm naturally going to become a problem later. Again, it's the same as Garen, the two-item spike. I think Yorick, I go Triforce, I think, and then after Triforce and then Hullbreaker, I just don't see what Teemo's going to be able to do to me, especially when I'm level 6 with Maiden and all of that, you know? Yeah. 
So I just don't see what he's really going to be able to do. So it does look like he's building a... He's building a build to try and be okay, I'd say, against me. Oh, that blind timing. I'm dead. That blind came back up at the perfect time for him. If I hit that Q, he was dead. Uh, it's actually telling me to actually go Divine Sunderer. Really? Hmm. That surprises me a little bit, but I guess it's just a lot of damage. There you go. Oh, Belveth. It does stem me kind of seem that Belveth might be tilted, which I probably am as well. Yeah, I should probably not risk anything early and just wait for late game. My own fault. It's my own fault. I think one of the best advices you could ever give to somebody, and like, I need this. What would I, if I was watching this game and I wasn't playing it, what would I be saying to this Yorick? And I would genuinely be like, stop risking things. Don't try to fight him. You win later. I, thank you for your yeah. I need to listen to the own advice that I would give someone in this situation. Even though that was a very close kill situation anyway, but yeah. But yeah, look, he's going AD Teemo, by the way. He's doing AD Teemo probably because he knows he can't stop me. But he has a better chance stopping me. If he goes AD. Think Maiden's dead. Yeah. Is this guy a one trick Teemo? He gives me those vibes. He's a one trick Teemo. Smurf one trick Teemo. Weird. I'm not building lethality. I can go standard. I know it outscales him anyway. I just need to get to two items. Yeah, three minute cooldown or whatever it is for Yorikul is really rough. But the idea is you're not really supposed to let Maiden die. But, I mean, that's quite difficult against a ranged matchup. We'll do what we can. Probably my last game today. It is to the grave we go. He's very obvious to what he wants to do. Bum ba dum bum bum. Remember when Teemo was like League's most hated champion? Not anymore. How many videos today? Two so far, which obviously is not very productive, but... You can still make a bit and do a bit of work as a bad day in the office. It's not the end of the world, you know? Yesterday we made five, so... Yeah. Yeah, I think the premise why Teemo is not really hated is if you look... Just look at the differences between modern champs and Teemo. Teemo used to be League's most hated champion. But then compare Teemo to Yone. Compare Teemo to all the modern champions. And Teemo's a saint. Can't even compare them. He's still annoying, you know. But he's not as hated as he used to be. I've just got to be patient this game. Because he's obviously got an incredible lead off me. Ooh, nice. Very nice. Good job. He's got a very big lead. Obviously, he got the first kill here. And then, obviously, we tried to kill him. And then Diego came by, unfortunately, at bad timing. Oh, good E. Did she survive that from that? Oh my god, she survived because of that E. That was impressive. Welcome back. You won't be here long. <gasps> He's definitely still about.
You hate Aurelian more than who? Timo. I can see Timo, but not like Yone. Right? Right? Bum ba dum bum ba da be do. Bum ba dum bum be da bum. I'm trying to think what boot do I go? Like, do I still go Mercs, presumably? Even if he's still, like, going a bit of an auto attack y build. I think so. I think Mercs will help me more. Still. Nice. Now don't be greedy. We got his ignite. We got his flash. Yes, he killed Maiden, but those are two things that this Teemo is very high, heavily reliant on. That's good. And that's without, you know, I don't have my items yet or anything. So that's a good sign. We're stepping in the right direction. This is a crazy aggro Belva. I think part of oh, part of it is definitely over aggression. Yeah, the ultimate is bad, but there is a window. Obviously, he'll have ignite back at three minutes, but flash is a five minute cooldown. So there is a window. There is a window. Hopefully, we can get a gank. If I can get a gank in this time period, that's great. That's why I'm pinging, like, come, please. Please come. Please. Yes, they come. Yes. Oh, hello. Very nice. Very good. Very nice. Oh. Oh, Aniara just sent me a new short to upload. Very good. Very nice. That'll be a weekend short. Use my Timo. I must dig. Watch them squirm. Oh my god, his damage is so high. Thank god the Belvest does damage. Jesus, I literally was about to just be dead from minions. That will slightly probably tilt this guy though, which is kind of funny. Thank you, Belveth. I appreciate you. What's one more grave? All right, I'm going to overcommit here for plates. Let's see how many I can get. They're about to run out in 20 seconds. If I can get two of them, that's basically a kill. Yeah, I'm going to get two. Again, unfortunately using flash, but I don't want to die. I am. I do not know what love mm. All right, got divine. Maybe I should have gone Merc Treads as like a rush item. Maybe. Ah. I'm gonna go Merc Treads next. Then I'm gonna go Holebreaker. That's the plan, Batman. Yeah, he's going quite. No, he is going AP. I thought he was actually because he's got Fleet Footwork. I thought he was actually gonna do like the Blade the Ruin King, attacky tack build, but he's not. Screw you, Teemo! Yeah! We outscaled him already. Let's go. And that's without Holebreaker. And that he ignited me then. Oh, let's go, dude. That's what we want, baby. It was a matter of time. See, since the beginning of the game, what did I say? Listen to the own advice that you tell yourself. And what I'll be telling yourself is you'll beat him later anyway. Just hang on and don't do something stupid. We get to the tower. Very nice. 
Let's do one more wave, why not? Hey, again, Maiden is something you should really try to kill if you can. And yeah, the enemy team is very much, let's say, on it to kill my Maiden. They like killing me Maiden. Wow, nice play. Go! That was very little damage. Did anyone else expect a lot more damage in that situation? I did. I don't know why. Maybe I shouldn't have. Was this a bad idea? Um, okay, you kind of entered that one, friend. It might be semi uh It might be semi-tilted in the uh, bot lane. Oh, wait! I am so dumb. It's been a bit of a day. Oh, I don't want to take that. You take that. Um, it's been a bit of a day, so I'm, I know I'm probably not playing my best. I'm not concentrating as much as I probably should, admittingly. It's Zyra carry bot lane. It's not Zyra support. It's Zyra carry bot lane. It's not really a thing. Hmm. Okay, Timo's over there. I was wondering where he was. I was like thinking, do you think Timo's going to be just in a bush waiting for me? Um, ping, how much? I know, 1,200 gold. I've got nine, nearly a thousand. I think I can get to Hullbreaker. Timo is not dead. Aha. He nearly died. We see how quickly I can kill this. Look at this. Right, I don't have hole breaker yet. Don't have hole breaker. And tier two's dead. Whoa. What the hell? That's insane. Oh dear, my team is kind of throwing. And the instant surrender, which is never a good sign. But this team was starting to lose to me quite badly, actually. I didn't want to go back yet because I'm. A little bit out of hole breaker. I'm going to keep pressure up. Might be a bad idea to do this. But even if I get one of the enemy here, it means that they're not going over to dragon. Yeah, I've got a hole breaker. Does he really want the maiden? Nice. Get a hole breaker, baby. Do I go bot lane? There is a shout for going bot lane because then I'm the furthest away from Baron, but I've got TP then and Teemo doesn't, so that's the advantage. But uh, the enemy team are all dying anyway. This is a funny game. Not terribly surprised if Diego's doing good. It's 
Diego. Champion is a strong champion. It's kind of weird that the music happens. I do like it, though. It's cool, huh? Yes, die, you little rat. <laughs> yeah, sucker. <laughs> What am I going to do? I'm going to thunk. I'm going to thunk, thunk, thunk. Hey, look, the enemy team is all grouped up down here. Wait a minute. Knock, knock. Who's there? Yorick Mori, don't forget my name, baby. I'm now in your base. Hello, enemy team. This is what I was talking about earlier, is I knew I could do this later. And there's not really anything that they can do about it. Timo can't stop me. The best bet, I would actually say, is Viego. But then you don't really want Viego to have to go against me. Da -da -dun 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 -dun. I'm gonna go bot lane. Now I go bot lane. I've got TP available. I go bot, then we have Baron pressure. I'm gonna go this item because then my ghouls will slow. I think. Do the ghouls slow? That Zed missed a lot of stuff then, wow. That's a tilted Zed. Alright, go away now. You did your good job. Did she pick Quinn to counter Zed? Because, like, I don't know about you guys, but I wouldn't have thought Quinn is a counter to Zed, but it's really doing well. Every time he engages, she just E's, and then it kind of, like, messes him up. It's quite interesting to see it, to be honest. Can't say I've seen a Viego do uh, a, a sorry a Quinn go mid and do really well before. The job team. So yeah, this is the job again. I knew I was against a Teemo, so what I did was pick something that Teemo can't do, and this is the negative. And there you go, GG. Teemo isn't modern meta of just split push and have no cares. Yorick is, Garen is, etc. And I think Yorick was better than Teemo. You know, we killed Teemo a couple times eventually, or once or twice, like. I don't think Garen may... My Garen may not have been able to kill the Teemo. I still would have had advantage later just from pure split push anyway. But yeah. So, again, that's a one-trick Teemo smurf. You know, he's he's not great in the current meta right now because he can't really stop the champs that just want to split push. Yeah, lane phase the Teemo will be good, clearly. But, Yeah. I'm going to give it to the Quinn because, again, I saw Quinn mid and I wasn't expecting much and she actually did pretty good. So we're on 22 win for a win, which is still bad considering we're all the way down in Diamond 4. But that means our next win, if we can get the next win, um, we'll be back to Diamond 3. I'm tempted to do one more. This was going to be my last game, but I'm tempted to maybe try do one more and see how it goes. Maybe I will. We'll see. Um, I know I'm not playing too well, so I'll have a think. But anyway, we go 1, 2, 3. Yes, I can count. 7.9k damage, nearly 8k. But obviously damage is against champions is not my goal. I'm against a ranged champion that can blind me. Like I'm not going to out damage. I did have more gold than the Teemo. And obviously what my assessment of if I've done well is not that. It's that. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, that is what... That's my goal. So the Teemo was the highest on his team with just under 3k. I did just under 12k. That's the game that I'm playing, and that's obviously what a lot of top lane has become, and Teemo can't do that. So that's the disadvantage of playing something like Teemo. Or you could even say the disadvantage of playing a Vayne top or stuff like that. They can't do that. <laughs> that's not what they are for. But yeah. Anyway, at least we got the win. If you guys did enjoy, do throw a like on it, throw a comment, throw a subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Call down the reckoning to bring back hope and peace. Restore our glory to live forever. Bring down the dark regime. I know how to unleash eternity.
no peace.